We're going on a field trip! Today, we are taking a field trip to the southeast region of the United States. Let's go! We are going on a field trip, going on a field trip. Yes, we are. And again, we are taking a virtual field trip today using Google Earth. So the first thing that I want to remind you today is when you load Google Earth, that we want you to play this as a slideshow so that you can move between each of the different locations on our tour. And for those of you who have the audio files, you can listen to those audio files and follow along as we are going through our tour. So yes, this is a project and it's called Tour of the Southeast Region. Once you get it loaded, so again, your projects is this little map button here. We want you to make certain that you load this project, which is the link in our assignment, and then go into the present mode. And then present mode, well, again, it'll start our slideshow. We have the table of contents down here in the left corner, and we can see that we have 12 different locations that we're going to visit on our tour. The other thing I want to remind you of is on the right hand, bottom right hand corner of your screen, that is where you have your tools so that you can fly to a specific location. And if I click this button, it's gonna fly me to wherever I am on the internet. Um, so wherever my physical location is that I'm using the internet in, then we have our drop person if we want to get in there for some street view. And I really recommend you do that, especially when you get into um, when you get into the into NASA and you can walk through Kennedy Space Center. And then 3D view, that again allows you to tilt your screen so that you can look at things not just from the bird's eye perspective, but also from a three-dimensional element. And then our compass, again, it will always reset the view so that we can see, like, it'll orient so north is at the top of your screen. You can use plus and minus to zoom in and zoom out. Uh, you can also two-finger scroll on your Chromebook, or if you're using a mouse with a click wheel, you can use your wheel to, to zoom in and zoom out. The other thing I want to remind you of the tours that we're going on when you are using Google Earth is that on the upper right-hand side of the screen, there'll be a white text box. Um, it's really important that you do, in fact, read that information because it will tell you what you need to know for your assignment for your works this week in order to better understand these locations that we're going to on this virtual field trip on this tour. So again, in the table of contents, you can see that we're going to, Ever we're going to the Everglades, uh, we're going to Kennedy Space Center, we're going to Jamestown, the settlement of Jamestown. We're going to a coal mine in Appalachia. Uh, we're going to visit Musical Memphis, the French Quarter of New Orleans, uh, Magnolia, which is an oil platform, an oil derrick in the Gulf of Mexico, um, a cotton plantation in Natchez, Mississippi. We're going to look at the Civil Rights Monument and this, the birthplace of the Civil Rights Movement in Montgomery, Alabama. And then as some additional national park features for us to go to, there's Hot Springs National Park, uh, the Great Smoky Mountains National Park, and Shenandoah National Park. And again, as you go through these places, I really encourage you to try to use that uh, Street View feature because it really does enhance your experience in this virtual field trip and allows you to see some really interesting things as you move forward. So these are the places that you are going to visit. Enjoy your tour. Make certain that you do read the text and you learn more about these different unique locations and why they matter so much to the Southeast. 
and take some time, drop in some street view points and really explore. Uh, Jamestown is super cool to explore. The Kennedy Space Center is really cool to explore. The French Quarter is interesting. Um, and then the national parks are, are really cool as well. So enjoy your time checking that stuff out. Have a great virtual field trip. Enjoy the tour. Use the features and be ready to explain why these things matter and how the music and the culture of the Southeast is defined by its environment. How are the landscapes helping you to learn why the culture and the music of those areas is the way it is? Thanks for being with me. I am Mr. Steyer. This is Mr. Steyer's Classroom. And enjoy that virtual field trip of the Southeast. Bye.